connectivity is a very wide concept. It is not only about transport. Very often when people say connectivity, they think it's transport, so maritime transport between Asia and Europe, uh, aviation, and more and more also land transport, trains going from China to Germany via Russia and Kazakhstan. But connectivity is much more than that. It's also uh, digital connectivity, the internet. Uh, it is also people-to-people -people, uh, connectivity. And here, of course, the Asia Europe Foundation is playing a very important role. Networking, connectivity, all these come together and would have to be discussed in detail in order to how we can move forward on this platform. And then this still the key elements which we will then bring to Mongolia, where we would then put it to the editors in chief to see how we can move forward. The world is small and it's getting smaller as time goes on. And one of the responsible roles of journalists is to actually bring to people in their own culture and in their own place the different issues and the different aspects that are important to all of us. Because by understanding one another, we make the smaller world a safer world and a better world. We need to actually just hear from each other, from the different, uh, see the things from different angles and from different colors, you know, so that way we can actually just collaborate to each other, together, so uh, you see, you will see the story from the different angles. The essence of a journalist uh, is that he can make it accessible. You we arrive to accept difference, that we try to accept the other one and try to understand. We don't need to, uh, to be perfect in another language. Uh, it is, the important thing is to communicate, to try to understand. They need to connect not just with journalists in other countries, but with the people of the other country and they need to learn about the culture and the ways that people are interested in different and diverse subjects in each of the countries that they want to target. I think it's very important to connect society, to bring society closer together, to inform them and in some way to educate them. Well, the most important thing is to hear different opinions and also to make um, a contact network with other people from different parts of the world, which we don't have always. I think the most important uh, thing is to have uh, proper institutionalized networks of Asian and European journalists because uh, many a times you have stories that you're following from Europe, uh, but you don't really know how to get more information on them. So, uh, and the biggest challenge that I have found is uh, because you don't have a network, because you don't know who to contact, let's say if you're doing a story in Spain, uh, you don't know who to contact uh, at, at a local level who could help you with either logistics or fresh information or validate the information you have. New networks of journalism between journalists in Asia and journalists in Europe have to be built. And the only people who can build that are the journalists themselves. They can use digital media, they can use social media. That we come out with is not just for the media, it is going to be for government, it's going to be for NGOs, it's going to be for the media out there to see what are the learning points that we can share with them. I'm sure that uh, connectivity will be high on the agenda for the ASEM summit uh, in Mongolia this summer.